Hello, my name is Katie. You're on the channel To Be Bed, and today I'm here with a belated November 2018 TBR. As with all my TBRs for the month, I have nine categories so that I can attempt to read diversely throughout the month. I don't always succeed, but I do try. The first category is to read a fantasy novel, and for this I have chosen to read Girls of Paper and Fire by Natasha Ungan, and I've just started a book club where I live with a couple of my friends, and this is our pick for November for us to read and discuss at the beginning of December, so I am very much looking forward to it. There is a trigger warning for sexual assault. Uh, but I'm very much hoping that this is going to be a hard-hitting novel and one that I'm very much going to enjoy as a fantasy novel. The next category is to read a contemporary novel and for this I've chosen to read Muffin Top by Avery Flynn. Now this novel is a cute contemporary romance novel and it sounds like it's just going to be an enjoyable read about a plus-size girl falling in love which I am very much looking forward to. The third category is to read a novel that was released in 2018 and for this I've chosen to read Pride by Evie Zaboy. Pride is a contemporary retelling of Pride and Prejudice with an African American cast and it sounds like it's going to be so good. I absolutely love this edition. It has beautiful end pages. I am very much anticipating this novel. The next category is Reader's Choice and that's just a free pick for me to read something that I'm interested in. And for this I have chosen to read Grim Lovelies by Megan Shepherd. This is a fantasy novel based in Paris and it just sounds like it is going to be amazing and detailed and lush and I am very much looking forward to reading this book. And the next category is to read a TBR jar pick and here is my TBR jar. Let's give it a shake and see what I pick. Okay. So here is the book and it is Matched by Ali Condi. And the next challenge is to read from the Read Your Shelf Challenge. And this is coming to an end as 2018 is coming to an end. So I only had two books to pick from in two bags. So I just picked a bag and the book that I've chosen is Metal Town by Kristen Simmons. I received this in a fairly box I believe in 2016. And I haven't read it yet so... That's a little bit shameful, I'm so sorry, but I'm going to aim to read it in November. The next category is to read a ARC novel, and for this I've picked a book that I've received from NetGalley, which is The Enchanted Sonata, and this is meant to be a nutcracker retelling, and coming up to the holiday season, I am very much in the holiday and Christmas spirit right now, so a nutcracker retelling sounds amazing and I'm really looking forward to reading this book. The next category is to read a novel that has been recommended to me and for this I am planning on reading The Boneless Mercies by April Genevieve Tulchuk. Not only is the cover absolutely beautiful but it is also a retelling and I love my retellings and this one is a retelling of Beowulf. And the final category is to read a short story collection. And for this I have decided to read The Assassin's Blade by Sarah J Mass and I'm going to listen to this on audiobook. I am doing an audiobook reread of the entire Throne of Glass series culminating in Kingdom of Ash. So I know Kingdom of Ash has come out recently and I am desperately trying to avoid all spoilers. Oh my gosh, it is so difficult. But I am determined because I don't want to be spoiled and I want to have everything clear and fresh for when I finish this amazing series by Sarah J Maas and I am 
so, so looking forward to reading this series in its entirety in one go and just thoroughly enjoying myself. Here are all the physical books on my November TBR. We have Girls of Paper and Fire, Pride, Grim Lovelies, Metal Town and The Boneless Mercies. I'm also planning on reading Muffin Top, The Enchanted Sonata, Matched and The Assassin's Blade. So I'm very much excited for my November TBR. That is it for my November 2018 TBR. Are there any books on here that you have read and would recommend or books that you are interested in reading? Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you for watching this video and if you enjoyed it please don't forget to click on the subscribe button and the like button if you would like. And for now, keep calm and read on.